What's up, everybody? New Never You here. And today we got four boxes of Dawn of Majesty that we gonna open or that I'm going to open. I got my sleeves right here just in case we pull a starlight. Uh, and before we get started, if you shop at eBay, TCG Player, or Inked Gaming for play mats, cards, whatever, use my links down below in the description. Helps me out, helps me get more cards so I can sell to you guys, and helps me play the games of Digimon, Pokemon, Final Fantasy, and Yu-Gi-Oh! And everybody just helps everybody. So it's a great deal. And all the cards that I don't keep um, that I put up will be on TCG Player under the Rex P. Fatalis name. So now that we got all that out of the way, let's get nasty. Uh, I do have two more boxes coming from somewhere else. I couldn't get a case of this set, which is thoroughly saddening because it has fairies in it. And if you don't know how I feel about fairies, you ain't been here long enough. Fairies in the color pink are what makes me wake up in the morning. So obviously I want the Despias. Um, there's only really one hard one to pull, which is going to be a Luber. The other one's, uh, uh, I would assume they're pretty... We see one's an ultra. One of the 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 um, quick play spell is a super. One's a secret. I think two 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 are supers because I think comedy is super as well, and then the rest are common. So four hollows, and that's it. Like four hollows. I mean, if I can pull three, Aluber, Aluber, whatever his name is, that'd be dope. If I can't, well, you know, I'll figure out a way to get it. But I also want the Iris Sword Soul and uh, the Protector Logolith Fairy Chick, the one that looks like Christia before she got a helmet. Yeah, you didn't think that, did you? You didn't think about that, did you? All right. Flying red carp, Despia, we got one. Dime, or is it Dimmer Synthesis? DD, dif, dim, oh my god. DDD, Different Dimension Derby, and a Magic Key card for the Super. So, Supers that go right here. Starter's Trail, Master Diploman, Margin Trading, and Gunkin Sunsu Ship Daily. Took it Gundam style. Uh, everything in this set is relatively cheap, so there's one Despia, there's a live twin Sunny Snitch, which apparently is, I think these are going to be good next set, uh, Burst of Destiny. Ooh, Alvain, what was it, Alvain, the Essence of Vanity. Hmm, I got a combo, I'm going to use this, but we're going to save that for myself. So far, so good. I'm not going to read all these because you can clearly see the name. Stall turn. I'll say the name of the hollows just in case you can't. Eh, that, technically, that's a Despia card, the branded cards. That ultra rare Synchro Wolf is going to be fire. I'm going to get a bunch of those because that card is going to be dope. Everybody's sleeping on all this stuff. And they're saying it's such trash. Mm-hmm. We'll see. Level 4, 2,000 monsters who ship. And we got Kermit. Kermit the Frog. Oh, yeah. I want the Bee Trooper stuff, too. This, sets, this is one of the sets that you need to build... Um, the correct word for it it's like what you need in order for things to be well oh sweet just two more of these 
This card is really good. If you don't know what it does, it's basically during the main phase, you can target uh, extra deck monster in your opponent's graveyard, banish it, or special summon it to your field. Um, when this card destroys an opponent's monster, you can inflict damage to your opponent equal to the original attack or defense, whichever is higher of that monster. So basically with this one and the ultra rare one, you make all their attack zero, you attack with this, hit them for 32, then burn them for whatever it was they had on the field, their original attack or higher defense, whatever. So it's if let's say you attack a dragoon, you and its effects are negated somehow. You have him and the other one out, you go. You know what? That's a bad example. So I'm gonna shut up. Basically, turn the attack to zero, attack him for full, and then you burn him for basically 32 twice or just whatever you have either way the card's good don't sleep on it because you get slip if you sleep on it you're gonna get caught slipping nobody wants to get caught lacking link apple apple link uh baby dragon starters master diplomat and the reason i'm not reading every single card or saying every card is because at this point in the game in Yu-Gi-Oh, other people get to read these cards before everybody. So I'm pretty sure everybody's already seen most of the videos. So there's no point in. Huh. B Trooper Scout Buggy. That's nice. These are like 12 bucks. It's probably going to go down, but, you know, I don't mind having it. It looks nice. That shimmer is gorgeous. Treatments are going to be fire. This card's good. And this card is probably good. I would probably get a couple of these, at least a playset. Don't sleep on the commons. Just because the card's common don't mean it's not good. And if anybody tells you that it's bad because it's a common, don't talk to those people. Boy, this is the coolest looking frog card. Ooh, another Gizmek. Uh, who would this be? I don't know. When I think of it, I would because the, the the frog is Kermit. Is there a, a rabbit in Sesame Street? I don't think there is. There's Miss Picky, there's Gonzo the Bear, or whatever his name is. Fozzie, Fozzie, Fuzzy, Fozzie, Fozzie the Bear. Um Three other single monsters in your grave return to the extra deck. Uh, these cards look like the same monster. No cap. I got a homie that want to build two ships. If you're watching this video, holler at me. I'll get you hook you up with these commons. For the small price of a Starlight Rare. That's my uh, second Despi here. Ooh, we got another B Trooper. Looks like we finna stain some folks. You know, I've come to... That's a strong normal monster. 1919. Diddle. I've come to the conclusion that, you know, there's no point in really getting excited about opening Yu-Gi-Oh! packs looking for a specific card. Because usually... That's the card I never see. But this though? Y'all sleeping on this. I've been waiting on this forever. I've been testing it for so long. And by so long I mean like six days. I'm 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 I'm, I'm gonna bust that deck. Y'all just wait. And everybody know what I do with fairies. It ain't no game. I ain't playing. Let's see, Chronomaly Magella Globe. That's actually pretty nice, considering most of the other ones look like septic poo. All right, next 12. I also want three of the, um, what's her name? Dore, Dore, Dore Me Cord. Oh, there's two trickster festivals. 
you know the worst part about opening packs and selling them is having to store them afterwards it's so boring let's see what we got we now get boot uh b trooper if the if i don't pull three of the dore mi core chicks which i probably won't because they're ultra um i'll probably wait to buy them and see if they go down to like a dollar ninety or a dollar to a ninety cents to a dollar and then pick them up then all right we got branded opening now i'm gonna look through these other ones real quick yeah okay nothing nothing there but this this is the coolest Anything Shirag is on is just automatically top tier art. I see Farajit. Let's see if I can zoom in. There we go. Is that? No, that's Farajit. And Shirag. Shirag is that dude that you want on your squad if something going on. He didn't fall Florida Lee and came out on the other side and she had a sword. Granted, he got this big old shotgun bazooka. Let me get it to focus. There we go. All right. We got one of them. This is the guy that if you fuse with him and he goes from to the graveyard or banish, you can special summon him again. And when a special summon monster hits the field while he's on the field, he can negate their effect or target a monster on the field and negate his effect. Busted. <sighs> And he got 3,000, so I am happy. That's one less card I gotta buy. One less card I gotta buy. What's next? 10 dangle, I'm gonna build 10 dangles too. I got a prediction princess deck that I've been working on. Yeah, everybody worried about the meta. Don't worry, I'm coming. Y'all keep sleeping. Let's see. All right, we got the hog. We got Miss Piggy. We got Kermit, Miss Piggy, and Rabbit from Winnie the Pooh and the Amazement Trap. Slowly but surely, we're getting there. Whoop it, Gungan style. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Huh. Misaya. So any card sent to the graveyard is banished instead except for monsters. I'm glad I pulled one of these because this card is gonna be really, 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 really good. Especially in Do Re Mi cards. Or um you could probably play it in Flunderese too. So, not a bad first box at all. Magic Key, Beast. I'm glad they made his, um, everything outside of him, Hollow. Uh, I think the Ritual, the Fusion, and I think the Xyz monster is in here. And all his spells are ultra. Everything else is super, and he's common. So the start is common, or what you need to start everything is common. I think that was pretty smart. And we got Amazement Delia, or Delilah. Delilah, De whatever. She's strong, and she helps the deck out tremendously. And she's cute. And yeah, y'all know what it is, fairies. Ah, uh, want ready fusion, but that's one of those cards that I'd rather trade somebody for than pull. If you know what I mean, like this one, Magic Key Maftia. That's a cool looking gun. It's a fusion card for Magic Keys. Oh man, is anybody else out there? Is the heat killing you like it is killing me? I guess it's not killing me. It's just very draining. Very, very just toxic for the body. So let's see what we got next. Night Ends Administrator. 
Hope you kept your night in sorcerers because uh that car might be coming back into rotation pretty soon. It's it's okay. It's not it's not the greatest, but it's definitely not the worst. And pendulum treasure. Add one pendulum monster from your deck to your extra deck. Face up. That's pretty unique. And we got a bunch of these. This car's going. I hope this gets a hollow upgrade. Why, new never you? Cause it's a fairy. You freak. All right, let's start on the second box. Alrighty. Arrival, arriving light. This is not what I wanted to see. <sighs> okay. Well, that um, should have been Oliver. I would have preferred it to be an Oliver. You know, how about we just get seven secrets in one box? That would be great. That would be awesome. Another globe. Let's see. I will sort all this stuff later. Right now, we just wanna pull Despia stuff. And at least one Iris, Tendangle. I can get the other two later. If I can get one, that'll be enough for right now. If I get a Starlight version, I want this, the, the standard version because I don't play with Starlights. Yes! Awesome. Despian, what was it? Cord, 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 Coritus, Coritus. This is the one that, <laughs> oh, excuse me. This is the one that turns everything that's a level, if it's not a level eight or higher fusion, its attack becomes zero during the turn it's activated. And it's a quickie. So, people that like to spam stuff and they got a bunch of monsters at the end of that nor or the end of that main phase, you activate that mug. I can attack, but ain't nothing much finna go on. And you can use this to uh, kind of extend plays for fusions, for uh, Despia stuff, or even. Uh, Dogmatica stuff is pretty decent card. Another one of Alvaz's many forms. We got us some B Trooper stuff to make some hot insects. What was it Storm Wasp or B Wasp or that B archetype that came out in Battles of Legend two years ago? I'm glad I kept all those cards. I'm finna break that deck. I say that about everything that I touch though. Cause it's you gotta look at every card, man. You gotta you gotta pay attention to every single card. Because cards do much more than people look at them. They look at them and they're like, oh, this is trash. Cause it it's oh, another B Trooper formation. Autobots. They look at it, they read it, and it's like, this is garbage. I would never play this. I would never play with this. And they lose to it because they didn't know the full function, function, the full functions of the card. Dino Wrestler, Iguano Draco. So, know the cards in and out. If you're not going to use it, at least know what it does or a summary of what it does so you know how to go around it if it is played on you. That's a fairy. I think this is a fairy, yep. And we got another Magic Key card, Magic Key World, awesome. I don't mind getting the Magic Key stuff. If it gets cheap, cheap, I'll pick that up too. All 
right. Awesome. Magic Key Dragon and Drum B May. They drop it May. That's a strong dragon. You gotta use a normal monster. So, I wonder what this worked well in Gemini's? Since they're technically normal monsters? Right? Right? Awesome. Place at a trickster festival. So, anything else other than that is extra. All right, let's move these over here. These are all commons for a box and a half. And now we're getting into this the other half of this second box. Let's see what fate has in store. Mm, pop my thumb. Yeah! 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 T -t -t totally dude that makes me happy we got an alibur i am one step closer to despius let's see what we got next pendulum treasure sweet one more of those and i can have a play set just in case i need it for my pendulum decks All right, the f second one of these, I think. I think so, yeah, I think so. I got two of one fusion, one of the other fusion, and two of those. And ain't no telling how many of they have of him. All right, next pack. Oh boy, y'all y'all better stop. Y'all better stop. We got two dramaturgs of Despius. Y'all better stop it. Put him in a coffin. He sleep. All right, next pack. Live twin. Sweet. These are pretty hefty for uh super rare. Almost two bucks. They were pre-selling at almost four. Man, feel bad for the folks who buying them was at four dollars. Wouldn't be me though. Stall turn. Let's see the focus. There we go. What? I got a banish card. I guess that's a good card for um what's his name? Grin Maju. Yeah, I guess that that that's that yeah. I can see that being in the Maju deck. Let's see. Sweet, we got the second one of this. One more, and my place of that is complete. I'm glad the Despia stuff isn't all high rarity, but I noticed most fairy archetypes aren't, which is good and bad. Um, which I guess it really wouldn't stop anybody from going out to get it if they wanted to play it. Got two Gizmet rabbits. All right, I just if I can pull one more Alibur, I'd be fine with that. I would want three. Huh. Be Trooper Sting Lancer. That's cool. I would I would definitely want three, but starting out with two wouldn't be that bad. I could live with that. I wish Candina was on normal and special summon. I think they did that on purpose because if Candina could be specialed in search stuff, that card probably would have never came out. That card searches everything in the archetype of Trick Stars. Everything. It's the fourth Trick Star Festival. All right. That was the second box. Second box was decent. Uh, yeah, second box was, was decent. 
We got eight of these, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I gotta check, cause last last time I opened products from Konami, I was sure the secret rare. Which was probably my diviner of the herald. Jerks. All right, we got a play set of the uh, Rabbit Gabbit. I think the other one is a common, right? I think the other two are common. Uh, right, this is the third one of this, I think. One of the magic key cards, the one where he's riding, the, well, I guess he's riding the beast on both of them. The one that's not a dragon. Second assistant, amazement assistant. Cuckoo, 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 cuckoo. Uh, right. This pack is heavy as crap. Two, three. Yes. One of these is very well welcomed. Very well welcomed. I'll go ahead and read it for the people that don't know. I guess I'll read the super, uh, the secrets and the ultras. Chronomaly Vidmana, two level five, once per turn, quick effect. You can target one face up monster on the field and one Xyz monster or Chronomaly monster in your graveyard. That monster on the field gains half the attack of the monster in the graveyard until the end of the turn. Then attach that monster from the graveyard to this card as material. Once per turn, when your opponent activates a monster effect, quick effect, you can detach two materials from this card and negate the activation. Negate the activation. So if you do that to an ash, they can do it. They can ask you again because you negated the activation. Just keep that in mind. The second B trooper, scout buggy. No, it's not scout buggy. That's a uh, armor horn. This pack's pretty heavy too. But ain't nothing in there. That's my play set of that. I got a bunch of these peacocks, which is great. Pretty sure that card's going to be real good. Level 2 Fairy Tuner. Yes. Yes. Oh, yeah. <gasps> oh, I wanted one of these so bad. It's so pretty. Let's see. Iris Sword Soul. Quick effect. Or during the main phase, if a monster whose effects are negated is on the field, quick effect, you can special summon this card from your hand. If your opponent special summons monsters except during a damage step, you can activate one of these card, card effects based off where it was summoned from. Hand. Special summon one monster from your hand. Deck. Draw two cards. Extra deck. Destroy one of those monsters special summon from the extra deck. 25, 25. And for the people that freak out that I don't sleeve things, I just, I don't sleeve them on camera because it takes too long. I got sleeves right next to me if it's, you know, for when the video's over. Mystic or Majestic Mirage. All right. At first, I didn't know what that was. I was like, what is this? It's so shiny. Uh, I think we got a play set of this now. Die Gusto. Is the next box gonna be a however? I mean, the next set of secret. Stardust Illumination. Tendangle. I think that's the place of the ten dangles. Right. And second hog. All right. What 
Jumping Gundam style. Gundam style. All right. Second half of the third box. Let's get it. Uh, branded opening. That's the second one. Need one more for myself. So I can start getting done with the combos. Done with the combos. Now, anybody watching, if I pull a Stardust uh starlight if you got the black rose and you want to trade holler at me if it happens black rose is my favorite signer dragon to albion of the shroud uh, albion the shrouded dragon right. Next pack. put that right there for the time Giant, giant B Trooper, tr mm, B Trooper Invincible Atlas. Link for two plus insect monsters. While this Link Summon card has 3,000 or less attack, your opponent cannot target it with card effects. Also, it cannot be destroyed by your opponent's card effects. You can have special summon monsters except for insect monsters. You contribute one insect monster, then activate one of these effects. Special summon one B Trooper monster from your deck, or this card gains 2,000 to the end of the turn. Just imagine, you getting obliterated by a big old beetle. Yeah, hey man, you summon that beetle boy and hit me for five stacks. Five stacks? Sweet pendulum treasure. I now have a playset of. Yeah, man. Beetle too strong. Beetle Jew, Beetle Jew. Whoop. Right, that's the second one of these. These boxes are giving me a pretty decent return on my investment. May not look like it now, but I've been playing and opening cards long enough to know how this stuff works. Ready Fusion. Well, I mean, I will not not take it. Ready Fusion, pay 1,000 life points, special summon one level six or lower non-effect monster from your extra deck, but it cannot attack, also destroy it during the end phase. This is treated as a fusion summon. You can only activate one of these once per turn. Not a bad secret at order. We need one more Alibur though, one more. Night ends administrator. One more Alibur. All right. Excuse me. I need to eat. Magic Key McMortar. All right. Eat and drink a lot of water. If you're outside working, make sure you hydrate. Sweet two. So I always get to have two. Cause I think I got a play set of the super. If not, I'm pretty sure I get another one out of this other box that we got over here. Oh, this is the first one of these. Dark magician stats. Oh, that new dark magician support they dropped? They leaked the other day. Well, I guess it wasn't leaked. They dropped it, man. That stuff is stupid. Dark Magician is, I don't care what nobody says, Dark Magician is good. Good, good. And it's funny that you can uh, make Dante with these bee troopers. <laughs> Burning the abyss, bee troopers. <laughs> That'd be crazy. Somebody will top an event with Burning the abyss, bee troopers. shall see next pack all right we got a play set of the amazement chick so i do not have to buy any of those plus i got two more boxes coming so i'm kind of scared to buy anything but if it's cheap i can i can spare a couple bucks sweet play set of the b trooper armor horn that's what i like to see this is what i like to see Extra Chronomaly Megalo, Megala Globe. All right. Let's see here. 
here. High ritual art. I think, is this a mystery? This card can be used to rich summon any ritual monster from your deck. You may, you must also tribute normal monsters from your hand whose total equals the level of the ritual monster your opponent, wait, you ritual summon. Shuffle that ritual monster into the deck during your opponent's end phase. That's not too bad. That, that, mm, I can see where it could be useful. Let me just say that. I gotta look at it and test it a few times before I can justify that though. So don't hold me to it. Majestic Mirage. It's a bunch of some ships. Alright, next pack. It feels like a secret rare pack. But it is not. Alright. Please don't skip out on my secrets. I can't take that disappointment again. It looks like I'm gonna get one of each secret, or at least one of each secret that I can, and oh, I gotta read that one, sorry. Synchro Overtake. Reveal one Synchro monster in your, in your extra deck. Choose one of the Synchro materials whose name is listed on that card and add that to your hand or special summon that monster from your deck or your graveyard. Also, you cannot special summon monsters from your extra deck. The turn you activate this card, except for synchro monsters. You only activate it once per turn. Uh, did we pull an ultra? Yeah, high ritual art. And I think this is the play set. That one, that one's a little harder to summon because you got to use a Despia monster and a light and dark monster. I just realized we didn't pull any of the Ultra Fairy Girl stall turn. And the Ultra looking Christia chick. Mm, ooh. We got Foghorn Leghorn. I say, I say, I say. Gizmek. Was it Naganaki the Sunrise Signer, Signaler? Signaler. You contribute one machine monster whose attack equals its own defense. Special summon from your deck. One machine monster whose attack is equal. Is is equal its own defense with a lower level than the tributed monster. You can banish this card from your graveyard, add to your hand one of your banished face down machine monsters whose attack equals its own defense. You can only use this effect of this card once per turn. Um, I might get all the Gizmet cards. I'm thinking about it. I'm gonna get prices after this video and see uh, what I can scoop up for a reasonable couple of dollars if it's not too much if it's not gonna break the bank and i can do some outrageous combos and yeah i'll probably pick it up mm, right magic key there's some good commons in here i'm i'm thoroughly surprised that some of these commons aren't hollows if we had rare still then they would be rare i know for a fact i know for a fact they'd be rare we got two of the Darkest Dragon Doom Rider. Like Stardust Trail would probably be a rare. All right, give me an Alibur or a Luber, whatever his name is, or a Iris Soul. I need two of one of them. No, uh, no debate. Wow, this is our first Despian comedy. That's insane. He harder to pull than the Ultra. Right. Yay! Grand Sofa Core Musicia. She is a Link to Fairy. Light. With 1900 attack. During the main phase, you can add one pendulum monster from your hand to the extra deck face up and one face up pendulum monster from your extra deck to the hand. 
as long as one of them has an even scale and the other has an odd scale. When you pendulum summon a sulfur core monster, you can target one of them, add sulfur core, add one sulfur core pendulum monster from your deck to your hand, whose level equals the pendulum scale of that monster. You can only use this effect once per turn. I gotta learn how that deck works. But the fact that it's a pretty fairy was really one of the reasons I wanted everything else. I think this is my third copy of that, so that's great. I got all that's this whole deck. But back to my original thought. That deck's probably good. The sulfur cords, I just gotta sit down and learn it. I've been so busy. B trooper formation with everything that I hadn't had time to actually sit down and make decks like I want to. And every time I get ready to, the format changes. Maybe I could just try it anyway. Yep, I literally got one secret of each. The only ones I didn't get was the majestic, the super majestic dragon and uh, the starter synchron, I think. During the main phase, you can act, you can excavate the top three cards of your deck. And if you do, you can add one excavated machine monster whose attack equals its own defense to your hand. Also banish the remaining cards face down. You can only use the effect of this card once per turn. Each time a machine monster is whose attack equals its own whose attack equals its own defense is normal summon or special summon, place one counter on this card. While this card has 10 or more counters, neither player can activate the effects of monsters on the field whose attack does not equal their defense. Talk about a bummer. That's I think that's the cheapest secret. One of the cheapest ones. I'm not tripping about it. Like I said, I came into this box opening just, you know, just opening the boxes that I bought, not having high hopes because last time I had high hopes, I got disappointed. So I'm just coming in with a clear mind, clear head. Seeing what we can get. And by we, me. Mar Majestic Mirage. Uh, two more packs after this. And it's going to be a wrap, everyone. Yes! Oh, I don't know why I got that excited. <laughs> Protecting Spirit Logolith. I think she's level 7. Fairy Light 24 21. If this card on the field is destroyed by battle card effect, you can target one monster on the field. It cannot be destroyed by battle this turn. You can only use each of the following effects of this card once per turn. If an effect if an effect of a fairy monster you control is activated, except during the damage step, you can special summon this card from your hand. You can target one face-up card your opponent controls and one attack position monster you control. Banish your opponent's card. And if you do, change that monster that you control to face-up defense. That card. <laughs> I get to banish something. Night End Administrator. Oh, my monster's in attack mode? Oh, wait. I put that in the comment section. Forgive me. Last pack. Oh, the first one of these. Cool, cool, cool. All right, everybody. And that is the Don and Majesty box opening. Like I said, I have two more boxes coming from another seller. Um, unfortunately, they just never ship stuff before it gets to release date. So I got to wait. Um, but it was cheaper than normal. So I don't mind. I do mind, but I don't, if that makes sense. Hopefully, we'll pull the rest of our secret uh, Iris Sword Souls and Alibers. If not, we'll just have to trade and get for them and, you know, do the new Never You Do. But thanks for watching. This has been New Never You. And if you did new, now you do.